Welcome to the NFL Preview. I'm here as Sideman alongside Colin Hill and Walt Higgins in third. We just saw the NFL Draft happen. With the top pick in the NFL Draft, the Arizona Cardinals took Oklahoma Heisman Trophy quarterback Kyler Murray. People didn't think he might not have gone in the first round until a week before the NFL Draft when everyone started saying last year's Josh Rosen didn't perform like he should have. So they decided that they were going to pick Kyler Murray. Colin, what did you think about the first pick in the NFL draft going with Kyler Murray? I thought it was a good decision to go with Kyler instead of Josh Rosen. I mean, he led them to a 3 13 season, which is going to get you nowhere. And I think Kyler can do, he can throw, he can run, he's good in the pocket. He is a little bit smaller, but we've seen that Drew Brees can do what he's doing, you know, a small height. So I think it was a good, it was a great pick by them to pick Kyler Murray out of Oklahoma. Now with Josh Rosen in Miami, Kyler Murray is definitely the top quarterback for the Arizona Cardinals. He will start this year. Well, did you think it was a good idea for Arizona to pick Kyler Murray even with Josh Rosen still on their roster? I think it was a good idea. We saw Josh Rosen not performing like he should have been. And even if Josh Rosen never went to Miami, he could be the backup quarterback. I mean, that's a decent backup quarterback decision. Backup quarterbacks are not perfect. They're for you to develop. And I think Kyler Murray is a good quarterback to roll with while you are either developing or trading Josh Rosen. Something that a lot of people were shocked about during this NFL draft with the Giants. The New York Giants took Daniel Jones in the first round. Now, the Giants had the 17th pick also in the NFL draft, which they had. So, was it a good idea to pick Daniel Jones with their first pick or not? What would you say? I think they made a terrible decision picking Daniel Jones. They could have gotten at 17. I mean, if you want a quarterback, there's a much better quarterback than Dwayne Haskins on the board going number seven. And I mean, at seven, and I think they made a big mistake on Daniel Jones. I think he'll be a bust. Personally, I think it was a good idea for the New York Giants to pick Daniel Jones, which we saw in Eli Manning, which was a smart kid out of Ole Miss, got taken with the San Diego Chargers in the 2003 NFL Draft, or four. We saw him, didn't want to play in San Diego, so they traded him to New York, and we definitely saw a good pick there. Now, they definitely wanted a smart quarterback. Dwayne Haskins, you know, he got in trouble once or twice in college, but also he had a five second, <clears throat> he had a five second 40 yard dash, which I think was a big game changer for the Ohio State quarterback, third place in Heisman Trophy, Dwayne Haskins. I personally think it was a good idea for them to take Daniel Jones at Duke. Well, uh, well, who, whoever to say that you gotta pick Daniel Jones, over Dwayne Haskins because Dwayne Haskins got in trouble in high school, I think they are horribly wrong. Guess who else got in trouble in college? Baker Mayfield. And look how he has turned out. Thank you, Walt. Thank you for watching the NFL preview. I'm here to sign alongside Colin Hill and Walt is his third signing off.